The difference between custom and prefab ADUs. Why should you build a custom ADU versus a prefab ADU? Hi, this is Kamal the Builder. We are asked that question a lot, so let's talk about it. So in this ADU, that's a full custom ADU, you see the customer gets to pick and choose their own countertops, their own cabinets, exactly the cabinets they want, exactly the countertop they want, exactly the layout of countertops they want. They pick their own appliances, for example. Here they wanted wallpaper, they have their own wallpaper. Each of these items in the kitchen and in the bathrooms, the same thing. Vanities of their choice, shower doors of their choice, shower tile, floor tile of their choice the mirror of their choice, medicine cabinets of their choice. So that's a key difference. Now, some prefab ADU builders have a palette and give you some choices, but you're always limited. And if you make any changes, it costs a lot more. So this is only the finishes. In terms of the design, because we do completely custom work, we can make the kitchen and living room of any size that you want. We can make bedrooms of any size you want, as long as we do everything per code, so we meet the building codes for California as well as your city. Similarly for bathrooms as well. So here's a quick tour of an ADU. It's two bedrooms, one bathroom, 730 square feet or so, completely custom. Let's give you a quick tour. So you walk into the living room and that's the kitchen on this side. Nice window here. Typically the kitchen sink has a window. This has a nice farmhouse sink as you can see completely custom countertops, cabinets, completely custom layout of the kitchen. This is exactly to our customer's requirement. And then we have appliances to our customer's requirement. And then in the washer dryer area, they wanted a wider washer dryer area because they wanted full-sized stackable washer dryers. In some of the projects, they even want side-by-side -side washer dryers. So we allow for that. And then as you go through this walkway, this is a little hallway that has one bedroom on this side with a pretty deep closet. So you're not really missing out on any closet space. And then you come back through the hallway, you have a shared bathroom in the middle, really nice finishes, and another bedroom on this side, also with a nice size closet. So basically completely custom ADU, two bedrooms, one bath, nice kitchen, nice living room, and we'll, we are about to wrap up this project. In the next two weeks, this will be completely cleaned up. What we've seen with prefab projects is some of the things are not discussed at face value. When it, some companies are advertising, they give you their lowest possible cost up front, and then you have these add-ons later on. Some companies don't let you know how much utility connections will cost, how much service upgrades will cost, how much trenching will cost as you have sewer, water, and electric coming into an ADU. Some companies don't tell you how these finishes would cost and how much each of these items would cost. So basically you want to dig into details, get all that pricing done upfront so you know exactly how much things will cost. If you're considering building an ADU and want a side-by-side -side comparison, an apples-to-apples -apples comparison of a prefab ADU versus a completely custom ADU, contact us, we'll give you all the details and we'll make sure you're educated and well equipped with all the answers before you dive into the project. Once again, this is Kamal the Builder. Thank you for visiting yet another one of my projects. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and to hit the like button and ring the bell so you're notified of future videos as we post them. Another important thing is comparing contract to bids. That's the next video we'll be posting. If you want to see that video, hit that link and you'll be able to see a video comparing different types of bids.